All right, what's next on the question list? All right, Mateso586 asked, what sort of character would a certain card games for the win? Voice, a silent Bob. I don't think we could ever afford him. Yep. Next question. <laughs> okay, Minecraft Lord 808 asked, what are your real names? Last name not required. There's one sort of little gag that we have running here because we have a bit of an A team when it comes to writing Kirby Bridged because I'm Kitty is Angela, AM is Anna well, Maria or Anna, and Koopa is Aaron. So we call ourselves the A team because our names all start with A. So and Jonah. Yeah. So That's, it's so it's Angela, Anna, Aaron, and Jonah. Who's Elder? At the end. And. Lena, Lena Lamont is, is Monica. <laughs> Alrighty. Next up, the Stinging Goomba again asked, Who would win in a battle royale, DDD or Escargoon? Whoever's got the hammer. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Next. Alright. DC Gits asked, Why the five minute later thing? It's sort of a homage to Yu-Gi-Oh! The Abridged Series of... Meanwhile, thousands of miles away... When in reality, you're only five feet away. We do... Five minutes later, not at the castle. Nice. Or back at the castle. Yeah, we, we do. We have two variations of it, and the, the joke is, is the center point is the castle. You see that a lot in the show. There's a transition to some other scene somewhere, castle. and they show the castle. Over here, they show the castle. So that's the joke. <laughs> it's either at the castle or not at the castle. <laughs> yes. All right, next question. What is your favorite meme in Kirby Abridged, Episode 1? Dude. It's the Rick Roll music, totally. That no, 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 Mike. Rick just plays behind everything. <laughs> for that one whole scene. Yeah, for that scene. whole scene. It's just funny. I'm a fire in my laser when he eats hot yep. food. Boom! We saw that. We thought it was really funny. We thought, we got to put this in that episode. No, we got to build an episode around this. we got to do something to make fun of this. And yeah. that was the birth of Kirby Abridged, was that meme. Yep. Let's go. It was Which, your idea. It was actually Eldrick's idea to put that in. You're right. He's the one that had Eldrick, the line. Do you have to any favorite meme? The fire in my laser one. Yeah. I came up with it. It's yeah, sort of unanimous. Right. Yeah, we all like that one. Alrighty, number fifteen. Why did you change the sales guy's voice? Uh, 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 well, we had to. Yeah, we thought let's let's make up a story about his voice modulator control panel was was altered a bit with import parts, and now he sounds like a Chinese guy. They we, know that, but why? We had well. We felt that the original voice was just not was not that good. Lame. Not salesmany enough. We need yeah. You need either a real fast talking mm -hmm. salesman, or you need like this guy Hop Sing Shade Tree yeah. salesman selling you stuff out of the back of his van because it's counterfeit from China. Yeah, we, and exactly. Alrighty, Mega Hog 2014 and Toby Vargas asked Jeepers that Mega Hog asked a lot of questions. He asked good questions. I thought. Yes. If you guys could not find a, the lost episode, Shell Shocked, are you guys going to vo fan dub it or no? No, never. We yes. are not touching it. Maybe. We'll think about it. It might be really hard to dub it without abridging by accident. Eventually, that episode is going to surface. It will surface. One day it'll surface, and our work will be for nothing. We'll have, a, we'll have like a worthless, half-abridged episode of Kirby. and. Because here's the other thing. Kitty saw everything up till about the last five minutes. That was when the show cut out. Yeah, for right, this the week in baseball. The second that the second Escargoon turned into a monster, it flipped a baseball. Yeah. So I it is very tears. possible somebody else in the world has recorded that episode and Maybe they just don't have internet access. I don't know. Maybe they don't know about YouTube. Maybe they don't know uh, that there's Our people out there. Maybe there's people out there that don't know it's lost. <laughs> or they're hurting it to themselves. Who? You fiend! <laughs> Who knows? So we can't... And they sit in their basement watching it over and over, reveling in the fact that they're the only ones who can visually see this right now. <laughs> yes. Hey, we, we, were that, we were at that point. Of one, remember, we had a, a whole pile of these lost episodes that weren't on YouTube, weren't anywhere. We could have hoarded them. But no, we decided to share them. <laughs> Next up, Kai Clark asked, Is there an episode of Kirby you want to abridge? <laughs> nope, we've, re we've abridged every episode we want to do so far. <laughs> oh, oh, there's a couple episodes we're still hoping to bridge. Lena? Oh, yeah. Six. Any yeah. name specifically? I mean, besides Pappy's Potty. Yes. We all know we're going to do Pappy's Potty. Oh, you can't song. wait to butcher that one. Oh, I just It'll be wait. fun. Yeah. Because she gets to play a part in it. Yes. <laughs> Is there an episode you'd like to abridge? Or you Probably just keep trundling along and do them all, maybe. Which would be fun. 
It's gonna be sad one day when we're at like episode sixty two and all that's left are really terrible. Really, episodes. really terrible episodes, including the first one. How about that? Epi- it's when you can take a turd and you can polish it and turn it into a lump of gold is when you're really good. Yes. <laughs> all right. Next question. Sui Ginto Maiden asked, "Did you all meet in the same place? I want to make my own abridged series, but the friends I have are all from different countries. Do we all meet in the same place? I wouldn't say technically, but." Coop and me have been friends since we were in diapers, and we needed some more voices to do Kirby a Bridge, so we brought on our other two good friends, A.M. and Eldrick, and everything just... Lena started. Lamont was just default. We knew we had to bring her in. Yes, uh, Well, she's our quality control. As far as starting your own Abridge series, our best suggestion is, yes, it does make things a lot easier if you have people local to you to do it. Because yes. if you're over Skype or something, it's pretty impossible. To We've had some guest voices who record their lines and send them to us, but that really runs into problems when the person doing the guest voicing is slow, or is not, not very good in, at yeah, emoting as an exactly. actor. Exactly. Their lines just really aren't coming out right. That makes for a lot of difficulties because then you're trying to meet your dead, the, the preset deadline you have, and the material is not ready, and it won't be ready until this person, who you have no other way of contacting besides email, um, gets their act together, and sometimes that can really take some time. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, Sugin Tomaiden, sweetie, Skeggy. I can tell you from experience that it is very difficult Five. to... It's very difficult Five. if you want to do an abridged series Five. yourself, and the people you want for voicing are in different countries, because it's a lot of work, and it brings a lot of delays going Talk. back and forth trying to fix things if things go wrong. It is so much easier but, when you have somebody, when you have your other voice actor sitting there right next to you, you have, give them my microphone, here, talk. It also so, helps for the voice quality of recording, because the person sitting next to you has... Will be working a, off the same microphone as you. Well, yeah. that, but they can also hear what you sound like and what you should sound like. Yeah, good yes. point. Yeah, it makes it easier to coach people for their lines. But as for distance, I mean, look what happened. Here we are doing Q&A, and Trunklet couldn't be with us because he's too far away, and he just couldn't make it today. And that's one of the reasons it's taken so long to get this done, is to get all of us here at the same time. Yeah. So Next. that is our advice for you, Suigin Tomaiden, but we don't, don't give up. No. Don't give up at all. We do definitely yeah. wish you luck if you want to try and do it a bridge series. Just remember, if it's worth doing, it's worth doing right. Okay, next question is... Destiny Willowleaf asked, How old were you when you first learned about Kirby? Oh, that's a cute question. It all goes back to the little gray brick Game Boy, little gray cartridge with a little white pillow character on the cover. I thought he was a pillow. We all thought he was a pillow because he was white, and I've never heard of a uh, like you know a white anything else. He must be a pillow. So it wasn't happy. until the later games we learned that Kirby was pink. Yeah, and therefore not a pillow. But he was still awesome. Still, yes. Still, the game every, we bought pretty much every single Kirby game there ever was. So you can imagine our excitement when we learned that there was a TV show. Yep. Imagine our disgust and disappointment when we actually watched it. Well, yeah, with how bad the dub was. Uh, uh, no, yes. I thought the dub was decent enough. It seemed it's no funny. different from any other show. But as you watch it, it gets better. Like Cartoon Buffoon, that was the real turning point for us. And it's like, what, episode 45? Approximately. Alrighty. And our last question is... Number 20, our most asked question. Will you ever abridge anything other than Kirby? No, that's not, not really true. Really? We have a couple other victims in mind, but we're going to pick away at the carcass we're working on right now. That's true. Yeah, <laughs> we gotta, we got to finish with Kirby I remember first. someone asking if we would do Sonic X abridged, and I would say no. Because no, because... Sonic X already has an, an established abridged series for it. That doesn't need to be replaced. And uh, the other thing is, the show's just bad. Why would you abridge a series that's already adequately abridged, like Naruto... Or you do, or something like that. Exactly. 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 Another series, it would have to be something that is unclaimed. Nobody, well, is either unclaimed or badly done, like we did with Kirby. Yeah, yes. like there doesn't exist. Some people there. have asked if we would ever do Hitalia a bridge. The answer clearly Hitalia is no. Hitalia is abridged. Very well funded. <laughs> we it can't is. touch it's them. The original abridged, abridged series. And here's the other thing too. With doing another bridge yeah, series, yeah. we're a little bit spoiled doing Kirby because all of the episodes are self-contained. So 
It's really, really yeah, they're easy. they're not a storyline where you have to do one episode after another or the story doesn't stay continuous. It's yes. wonderful. We can just pick and choose whatever episodes we want. It makes for a really good show. Yes. So we're not. We're definitely not doing a new bridge series right now. At but the same time as the one we're currently on. But maybe when time comes that we've worked ourselves through every single episode of Kirby a Bridge. Or as many as we want to do. True. That we would consider going to a different project. But first things first, of course. Yes. Yep. Yes. So either way, thank you all very much. And we're very happy to have answered all these questions. We hope you enjoyed. And we hope we've answered your questions adequately. Thank you for watching Kirby Abridged. We are so delighted and thrilled with our fan base. We think you guys are awesome. Yes, keep yes. watching. And keep tell watching. Your, tell your friends. <laughs> Share the pink puffball we all love. Bye. Bye. Bye.